you know, I, I'd be I'd be angling for a Samira or a Ningala if this was another team. But it is D+, plus, so it will just be the Ash. Also solves, I think, the issue of Rel being the only form of engage. Gives you a little bit more uh, when it comes to trying to threaten. Because I think this DRX comp is really... Blue buff is okay. Canyon moving on in here. As Death could get into the brush, he's across. There's the no game. way we could possibly know that this is happening. Yep. This how, is normal. How could you guess? As they're going to go for it. Barrel in trouble, and he will just be taken down. It's first blood going over to the ash. Uh, oh, no. Oh, dear. Fate going to flash. Does get out of the way of the, of the snare, but. Say no, it's triple cop. Oh, no, it's uh, not. Either side. Yeah, no, I just want to be up front. So. Barrel. It, yeah, I have no idea. Uh, he was I, trying I, I to deny to a crash down, I guess. But yeah, but you can just peel back. Yeah, I mean, and let the turret. I don't know. If I saw a Krug wandering into my lane in bot lane, and I didn't know about Nico, then I would also panic. Okay. Oh, all in on top side here. Yeah, Rascal taking the worst end of it at this point, but the ruthless predator comes out. Just inherent controls. We're going to check out this bottom lane fight. Barrel still level five. Depth throwing out autos where he would like. Cross shots working out. Oh dear. Oh now he's a raptor! Okay, he's not he's not gonna freak Beryl out again as it's, it's getting flanked. But how many ashes are there? The headbutt comes in, but Beryl is still dead. Canyon very comfortably grabs that kill. And now Paddock is gonna get magnet stormed and taken out. Death tanking the turret. There is a nature's grasp that Fate. flies through. Fate looking to come in. Kellen will be the first one to go down. Gets himself a reset as the volley flies in. Fate flashes his head into the wall, and that is a double for Showmaker. Really, really I, poorly. Uh, Oh, well. Kana gets a soul. Now it's worse. Okay, now they are neck and neck. Kana is one behind. It's currently sitting at nine, and I believe I'm, Rascal is on ten. I'm sorry. Okay, I didn't mean for it to actually happen. Yeah, that was a that's a it's a cast of a big difference between a player that is very good at Nico and a player that's kind of played a few games on Nico. Though, oh, yeah. like the skill express, like being able to utilize uh, shape splitter effectively and having the 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 adept mind games. Yeah, that's uh, it's real difficult. Um, as a uh, yeah, we take another look at this and kind of get the Counter Strike back. I here's Jax. This <laughs> has just been it. Yep. And Arrow gonna find him once again. He is going to press his uh, ultimate button this time, uh, and he's gonna go for an engage. Finds Kellen, but now he's kind of by himself. Kind of gets into the back line. Paddock, you mentioned melee range with the Jax, and it's once again a bit of a problem what? there as the Empower just pops him like a balloon. Fate now looking to run away. That's a jump scare as the Jax comes out of the brush. Shock Blast. Juhan going to avoid that damage, but the Jax himself is going to be a problem, and Depth is going to slow him down and take him out. He's Hex flashing his way over. DRX all grouped up, looking for this opportunity, but Kana is over the wall. The flank angle is fantastic for the Jax. And Beryl, he has to ult very, very early in this one. Kellen in the back of the pit, and DRX realized they cannot do anything about it. Still, Beryl tanking for a long time. He will now die because the ult has worn off. That is a headbutt onto Kana, though, before he does fall. And Beryl survived for a really long time. The Jax goes down first. Beryl walks out. What the heck? How dare he? As Showmaker is going to chase after him, we'll take him down. And DK will definitely win the fight as Canyon goes golden and will deny the crocodile is kill. Fate now underneath the turret. And DK, they're running out of health bars. Though, not part of that. No. Doesn't go on the resume, I don't think. As Nature's Grasp comes on in, they're going to try to get out of this one. Decent Chains of Corruption for Paddock. But Kellen is tanking for days. They do manage to take him down, but now D Plus are closing in. Paddock going to be Deft's first one, and he's going to flash for it. The volley picks up the kill. They have the vision over the wall as well as Blastcone is The Dream? The Steal? The Alpaca. Okay. Rascal and Juhan. Fate is here as well. Tree with a dream. Yeah, Kana's gonna flash in. He finds a huge Counter Strike stun. The Pop Blossom to get rid of the Crocodile. And Fate not gonna get snared. But Kana is not gonna let him escape. Never mind the Buster Shot. He's going to be there. The okay, that was not exactly the the Q you were looking for there. Showmaker, but it doesn't really matter as everyone explodes. And D Plus, they'll go back to the Baron potentially. Although their health bars are relatively low. Paddock not going to be doing anything about Get him, Paddock! Come on, man, you can just hit him with enough arrows! Um. You can do it! <laughs> <laughs> no! Canyon's just floating. What, what happened to the virus? 
don't care about this. I wanted to see what happened. Okay. Now the nature's rust. The dragons are flying through, but the arrow is going to last here. Beryl! He's your former teammate as the Pop Blossom's going to pick up two products. Like, all right, I'm out of here. We are done with this one. It's a double for Deft in the end. Ah, you know, that's, that's, okay, yeah, true. that's a blast from the past. He's never experienced that. Uh, in a row here, if they are able to kill room. the Nexus, which I assume they will, as here it is. Um, this is from uh, Deft's uh, perspective, and he got hit ah, with an arrow. The Archer got hit with an arrow. Thank you. I'm glad we got that, that cleared up. Uh, it hurts. Silly Hail Mary plays. Another oh, one. Speaking Can with, they yeah. kill Connor? The dragons. Oh, there were so Off many into people. the distance There's as he so blasts Cone. Showmaker comes on over. Kana is kind of huge and does have a stopwatch. That'll stop the explosive charge, and he's now dead. But survive. Well, not. That's one. Took a lot longer than I was expecting. Barrel going to get jumped on, though, and now it's a one for one. Canyon. Oh, dear. There's a buff blossom. And everyone just to go, oh my, to the skies, kill two people. It, it's please. a full house, depths full of showmakers, and oh, just and kill it. the Nexus. And it, please. We <laughs> have Infernal Soul Atlas. Yeah, I think, yeah. I mean, it's been done for a while, and Showmaker, he's going to get to it. Of course, Showmaker is the man that does like going home as early as possible, and he's going to see that they are going home early. And yeah, the melee minion. It's just going to wander into the fountain, uh, as Canyon likes to do. Um, Beryl just <laughs> flash pulverized. And Canyon goes down. There we go. Beryl locks down the solo kill. And the Nexus is going to fall. D plus Kia. 2-0 this evening in, um, yeah, very dominant fashion. If you're a D plus gear uh, fan, this is the type of victory that you want to see yeah. as well, because Absolutely. it was like it was kind of also keeping himself together. You can see in this moment, um, beating the entire team in, surviving for a really long time. But outside of this, actually, his jacks was incredible uh, in this game. Playing the LeBlanc as well, champion pull has always been an issue for Kana. And you can see he's got a huge grin on his face after falling down there. And I want to draw your attention as well to who D plus is facing, uh, which is Liv Sandbox, a team that right now is really struggling. Yes. And uh, T1, who uh, obviously, with Faker not being part of the team, have uh, kind of succumbed to issues that were plaguing them before, but truly now uh, look to be uh, look to be somewhat lost. So 4D+, their next weeks give them an opportunity to really build up some steam until they face off against, say, a Hanwha Life. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Let's kill Alistair one more time, is what they said. And we <laughs> know what's going to happen here, as Beryl uh, is going to be able to stand around and say, sorry, Canyon. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs>